Hey y'all, this is Emily. And Hunter. And this is Ohana Slime Review. Today we are reviewing um, a shop called Deer Slime. If you haven't noticed, all of our slimes have mostly been on Etsy. Um, we're just trying to support the smaller shops. Um, and we have some coming up that are brand new. Uh, we do have some reviews uh, coming up that are on shops that have almost zero uh, sales. What? Yeah. We should that. We should get them. We did. What? And they're on their way. <gasps> yeah. <gasps> so without further ado, I first of all, I really like the cute little bears. Yeah, that, that they put on there. Cute. They're that's really adorable. cute. All right. They, so let's open this up. This is gonna be fun, I bet. Oh yeah. Cause that have a special surprise in there. We have a special slide just for Hunter in here. All right, so first, we are going to do Hunter's surprise slime. So Hunter, close your eyes. All right, open them. What's this? Mario? It's a Mario slime, and it's a DIY slime. Oh, can I have this? That's a, that's a clay piece, baby. Can I have the clay? Can I have the clay piece, please? I'm going to keep this. Yeah, you can keep that because it is. I bought this slime for you. So you ready to smush it? Yes. Three, two, one. Oh, wait, we forgot to smell it. Mmm. No, what? this is supposed to smell like mango. I don't think it smells like mango, but it smells pretty good. Oh, look at it. There you it. go. Smish. Oh, that's so, Smish. so hard. It is getting a little tough, but with clay inserts, it does get tough and then it softens up. Hunter is always like really big into the charms. It's super cute. It's Mario mushroom. Yeah, it's a grow mushroom. Yeah, when Mario grows, it's so cute. Well, well, now this is a butter slime. You want to squeeze it? Sure. Oh, oh, there are some soft pops. It is a little tough, but not too tough. It is spreadable. Look at this. He just popped up. Yeah. So, Hunter, oh. what do you give this slime? I give this slime... Um, uh, 10 million out of 10. Like, out of 10, how, how what do you give it? Uh, um, 10 out of 10. A 10 out of 10? Why 10 out of 10? Because I love it. Because you love it? Thanks for the surprise, Mom. You're welcome, baby. I love you. All right, let's do the inflation test. Oh, let's get all those bubbles out. Everyone will hit the plus button. Let's do the jar test. Oh, it inflated a little. Well, you gotta remember we added clay to it. So it might inflate a little bit. Um, I don't like how there's not any labels on the front of them, but the um, mm -hmm. name labels are super cute. All right, to the next slime. Okay, so for the next slime, before we do that, we are going to Check out these super cute little extras. Of course, we got our borax. Yep, so cool. And now you know I love how uh, Activator, they bring it to you pre-mixed. They did. It's uh. just so convenient, so thank you. And they have a watermelon airhead. Oh, airhead. Which you're going to have to wait on because you have a sucker in your mouth. Yeah, I can. Yeah, you can. And they have. You can have it. And we have these cute. This little is watermelon. Strawberry stickers. Oh, yeah. And it has the activator recipe. And it says, you know, thank you. Little thank you card. All right. Now we're going to save the coolest one for last. Let's go to the next slide. Now this one leaked a little bit, which is which is okay. This is 
uh, Sakura Crunch. This is a clear crunch bomb slime. And you see it's leaked a little, which like I said, it's, it's okay, it happens. It didn't leak all over the place, which that's what's most important. Um, it's not as clear as I thought it was going to be. Well, like I said, it, it, it's, it's not as clear as it said in the picture, but it's still fairly clear. Um, it just looks like it needs to sit for like a week. So this looks freshly made is basically what it is, which is, you know, fine. I have fresh made slime. And it came with these cute little pearls. Uh, the big pearl, we are gonna save for the churn bag. It smells like lemon drops. Let me, let me smell. That smells really good. How pretty that is. Yeah, it's so pretty. I wish it was clearer, so you know. That way we could see them, see the flowers a little better, but it's still very pretty. I wish the amount was a little more, but that's okay too. It has good pops. Mm-hmm, good pops. And it did not even need any activator. Hunter, I think you could even play with this. Let me feel. Oh. Um, Now the flowers are a little pokey. Um, that's the main reason I wish there was a little bit more of an amount. So seeing as Hunter can play with this. Yeah, this is, this is so happy. That makes me really happy and it smells really good. Mm -hmm. It has really good pops. Um, I am going to give this a seven and a half. I'm going to give this a ten out of ten. You're giving it a ten out of ten? Why are you giving it a ten out of ten? Because it, it doesn't stick. It doesn't stick, and that's very important. I'm giving it a seven and a half because the flowers, although they are pretty, they are very, very pretty, are very pokey. Um, like, very, very pokey. Um, and again, that's why I kind of wish there was more of an amount. I do like the smell. It smells like lemon drops. Lemon drops, sorry. Um, and it was, you know, it wasn't clear. And it's supposed to be a clear slime. But, um, we will let this sit, sit for a couple days. Ooh. Mm. And see if we can get it a little more clear and see how it does. Yeah. We'll see. Now, let's see if it inflated. I don't think it did. I guess not. I guess not. And this also did not have a label to it. But again, I do love the cute little stickers. Yeah. All right. To the next slime. Yeah. All right. This one is also kind of a surprise for Hunter. Um, this is a Kirby Floam Block Slime. What? Kirby? I love Kirby. Now see, it has those new block I see Kirby in there. I want Kirby out. Isn't he cute, y'all? He's so cute. So you know, Kirby has been around since I was a kid. Wait, what? Yeah, and I'm old, y'all. Yeah, she's... But she, I still love her. Oh, thank you, baby. I'm gonna... All right. I'm gonna her... So this is supposed to be grapefruit scented? I'm gonna let Kirby chill. I'm not a fan of this one. Let me let me poke first. Oh, smell first. 
Oh, it smells good. You like it? Smells, it? See, I don't like it. It smells like strawberries. Well, it's supposed to smell like grapefruit. It actually does. And I love grapefruit. I, I don't love this smell. So let's put in the blocks. Now, this is my first block slime, so I'm excited. And Hunter, this, I'm pretty sure you could play with too. So far, none of their slimes have needed activation or activating and are um, not sticky to the point where Hunter uh -huh. can play with them. Ooh. Here. Squeeze it. And that's a clear slime, y'all. He's not, he's, him and clear slime, those, that's very good. This is, I believe, a coated clear, which means it's a little less tacky, but still, um, Hunter and clear slimes, they're usually not friends. Again, I just wish that there was more to it. I know these were four ounces, but they seem kind of small even for four ounces. Don't you think it's a little small even for four ounces? Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right, so Hunter, what do you give the Kirby slime? A 10 out of 10. Another 10 out of 10. I'm gonna give it another seven and a half out of 10 because the smell, I, I, I can't deal with the smell. It is not good. At least not to me, it's not. Um, I wish there was more of it. I don't think there is an actual like four ounces in here. Um, I don't have a scale. You don't? No. Um, but this, That does not look like four ounces to me. Um, I could be wrong, and if I am wrong, I am sorry. Um, I wish there were a few more foam beads in here. I do love the pops, it does give great pops. And it is, all in all, a very super cute, poppable slime. So, shall we do the jar test? Jar yes. test? Because it looks like it's kind of inflated a bit. All right, and it has not, which is fine. So that's it for our review of Deer Slime. Um, all in all, I thought they were good. I, I think I thought they were pretty good. I'm gonna give the store an, an eight and a half out of ten. What do you think? 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. All right. All well, these stores are 10 out of 10. That's saying a lot. So far, I think we've done pretty, pretty good. All right, so that's it for this review. Like, subscribe. Comment down below. And smash that oh, notification bell. bell. Peace, love, love, and family. Bye. Bye.